Welcome back to how to use APIs with JavaScript on Code Academy. In this lesson, we're going over parsing XML. And it says parsing XML. XML, which stands for Extensible Markup Language, is very similar to HTML. It uses tags between angle brackets. The difference is that XML allows you to use tags that you make up rather than tags that the W3C decided on. For instance, you could create an API that returns information about a pet. So we have a pet tag, which contains name, species, and then we close the pet tag. As long as you document the structure of your API's response, other people can use your API to get information about pets. Instructions. Check out the code in the editor. It's very similar to our earlier request but specifically asks for an XML document in return. Click Save and Submit Code to continue. So if we look at here, we can see it looks very similar to what we did before. We have a variable where we save our XML HTTP request. Then we open and do a GET request. So we do the open method on our XHR object, which does a git request to codecademy.com. Here we see XHR.set request header and we give it content type and text XML. Then we send our request. We then take XML document and assign to it our XML response. Then we console.log the XML document's child nodes. So we run this, we can see what we get back. And we do get Gustav, dog, roost, duck. And we'll learn more on exactly why this is all working in the next lessons. See you guys then.